So hi everybody, I haven't vlogged in a while, but um, I was thinking recently and I've been noticing a lot of spam mail, like or spam messages. So for those of you who've come across some of my vlogs, you've probably heard me rant about, you know, the crazy um, spam messages that I've received or the people that, that think that, you know, you can tell, they tell you that they love you and you'll send them money. That's a whole other story. That's a, I'll get to that in a minute. But I've been noticing lately a lot of spam messages via like Instagram mainly. And it's basically been for a lot of profiles on buying followers. I've never personally bought any and I have no interest in buying any. But when you get bombarded multiple times a week by these, you know, slap together profiles that you kind of wonder if it's really run by a person or a conglomerate or a bot or somebody just kind of slap stuff together hoping somebody's going to think, yeah, I'll, I'll get a thousand followers for $99 and it's all good. But I always kind of find it funny because I don't know now if it's because I had to switch my Instagram account to a business account for um, some collaboration work that I've been doing, but I've noticed it a lot more. And it's always interesting because they I've noticed a lot of the uh, profiles tend to do like group message spamming where they just I guess go down a whole list and then they just send out a general generic message stating something to the effect of you know grow your business today or grow your following and it tells you you know organic follows what exactly is an organic follow can somebody explain that to me does that mean that you know the robot's going to just say oh we'll pick five people and we'll add them to your account or we'll pick you know 15 people and they'll be added today and then you know next week they'll be gone so it's kind of interesting on how the buying followers process works. Again, I've never bought any. I'm not interested in buying any. But it just seems that there's more and more of that going around lately. And uh, let me know if you what you guys think about it because it's kind of interesting all in all. And a lot of them, a lot of the pitches are so hokey that you know that they just copy them from somewhere else and slap them together and try to rearrange the wording a little bit to make it look a little different. But a lot of some of the websites I've actually Googled and it just kind of been nosy to look at. And a lot of them have like bare bones, bare bones um, graphics and stuff. It's basically just, you know, your white screen, your little banner that says, you know, XYZ uh, company, buy followers today. Or it'll have like, just like I said, it's basic bare bones. And it looks, some of them look kind of shady because they don't even have any, um, frequently asked questions or customer service contact or anything and and you wonder you know who's going to really think that they're going to fork over $99 and get 10,000 followers for their their profiles which is weird and now they're even doing like the niches where it's like you can break up your payment and they can give you so many followers for Twitter and so many followers for for YouTube and so many followers for Instagram and the list goes on and it's crazy. You really wonder where your money goes, at least I do. Because I'm like, if I'm gonna spend $99, I wanna know that it's gonna benefit me in some way, not just to have a bunch of fake hollow accounts that people slap together with some pictures from somebody from, you know, wherever and and Fred from your neighbor <laughs> from around the corner. I mean, it's so easy for people to take pictures now or to uh, copy pictures from people's accounts and things that you never know if it's really a real person or if it's just, you know, a bot or something. But I just thought I'd have a little chat about that and um, getting back to what I had previously said. So I went from having all these, you know, people that decide that they want to date via Instagram to bulk messages of, you know, let's, let's grow your following, which is interesting. And I did actually have somebody recently uh, ask me for money. And I mean, they straight out asked for money from um, on or via Instagram. And I'd never had that before. I'd had people ask for gift cards and things. If you guys go back, you might be able to see or find one of the videos in the vlog. But I actually had somebody literally just say, you know, you have money like that. And I'm like, excuse me. And the person's like, I need. And I'm like, no. I, I don't understand what you mean and I just went ahead and I reported the account and I alerted a couple people that are my Instagram friends because apparently they were following the person as well. So it's just it's crazy between the mass 
followings and mass unfollowings and then you know let's buy followers and everything else it's just nuts these days so i just thought i'd spend a couple minutes ranting like a loon about this but um i hope everybody has a good day and let me know what you guys think about it if you guys have been affected by any of these things like the you know mass spamming of of purchase followers or if you've even bought followers i'd like to know exactly what you guys think about that too because i as far as i know i've never talked to anybody that's bought followers so that'd be an interesting back and forth um i'd be very happy to chat with you if you'd be if you'd be willing to um other than that that's about it so i hope everybody has a good day bye